what fun it is to make HSN your home for the holidays. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900. Transform the look of your skin with the natural beauty essence of grapes. And the Somme captures the finest grapeseed extracts in luxurious formulations, helping to smooth and nourish with moisture, diminishing the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. Discover the beauty of grapes. Discover the beauty of Emma Somme. to have you shopping with us. My name is Marlo Smith and I'm your host. And this handsome gentleman happens to be Mike Mizak. And Mike is actually a coin expert or in better terms, he's actually a numismatist. And so it's wonderful for you to be joining us. The show is jam packed. We've got a two hour great show for you. We've got tons of brand new. And I was mentioning to Mike that we've got 60 days to Christmas, 60. So as you're watching the show tonight, not only think of things that you'd like to add to your collection, but definitely think of great gifts to give. Because I think as we have on the schedule now, that is this and we we only have this and one other prime time uh, or two other prime times before Christmas. That's it. Okay. So it's, all right. Yeah. So this is really limited. Yes. Um, right out the gate. How it's, good is oh, this? It's so cool. Tell us about it. This is an actual coin. It's 24 karat gold, as you can see. Look at that. That's and there's uh, uh, Palau is the country. It is a $1 solid gold coin that you have right there. And see the way Neat. they've done it, how they've done it. So the eyes flash in that with the mirror on there. I mean, it is that's spectacular. Really uh, like I said, a solid 24. That's not layered or plated or the anything like that. This is the real deal. Solid 24 karat gold. When was the last time you get anything solid? 24 karat gold for $99.95, <laughs> let alone with three flex pays. Right. And you've got this the very first time a skull coin has ever been done. You know, we're coming into Halloween here, so I figured oh, yeah. that, uh, you know, this is a theme. They did 15,000 of these. I had, I got 200 of them. Okay, and we're one of their biggest customers. These are, and I, and I have less than 100 right now. Well, the whole so we started with 200 plus. Right, so sell out quantities on this one. Mm -hmm. You'll need to act quickly. Yes. But skulls in general are huge, like in fashion, um, you know. Well, we're in Tampa with the Gasparilla. Gasparilla, just coming up. You know, so I had to pull, you know, about 15 of these out of this, and we have a silver one here oh, just for gifts for friends well, locally. It's a big we thing. We even have a, a wonderful jewelry line here where mm -hmm. they do lots of skulls. I mean, it's King Baby, so it's real hip. It's real cool, you know, to be able to have it. But in gold, my gosh. Now, it appears to me, and I don't know if my eyes are deceiving us, telling I'm having trouble seeing. Is he smiling? Yeah. It's kind yeah, of, so it's not as macabre as you think it is, okay? <laughs> so it's really, he, he's kind of a happy skull. Yeah. If you look at that, he's I got like that kind of... I like it even better because of that. He's kind of got that, that grim, look right there, which I absolutely... Remember, 20, solid 24 karat gold. Now, I've got one other thing here. I'm going to flip this. I've only got 48 of these. This is already sold out in oh, limited edition. Oh, this is great. This is the solid silver skull coin. Look at this. Check this thing out. I only got about a minute here. So cool. One ounce pure silver, $5, 1750 I've only got 31 left now. 31 of I these, know. and that's it. I can't get any more. And uh, Marla, you have the certificate of authenticity, which that's, is that, really cool. I mean, they're both great. And then the box that comes with this, one ounce done in the antique silver uh, oh, with this. Oh, look at that. Just an absolute that guarantee. That is cool. Isn't that cool? Oh, so we that's love this the box one. it comes in. And it's on four flex, guys. So yeah, I had 125 of these. I think almost these will sell out. That's oh, awesome. No uh, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to take, really cool. take this coin. And like I said, it is a coin. One ounce oh, pure neat. antique silver. Look at this. I mean, for the person that has it all, 
Yeah, they don't have this. Yeah, they don't have that. So we this. all know someone that's like that. They're accomplished. They have a lot. They don't have that. That's what you get them for the holiday season. Yeah, and so. then there's the certificate of authenticity, as you can see. Only 1,750 pieces for worldwide distribution. 1,750 pieces. I've got 30 seconds. I've got 30 pieces. I'd love to so have these that will, piece. Isn't that great? Well, it's, I, I'm afraid <laughs> it will sell out that's on you. Like I, I said, one ounce pure silver done that. in the antique. I tried to get more. I mean, I called. I begged them. Uh, I, and it just is that's all that's all we're gonna be able to get. okay so we'll keep you updated okay we have about two dozen remaining in that one and that one would be sold out so enjoy what a way to start the show I can't wait for you to see what's coming up in just a little bit as a matter of fact here's a little bit of a preview mm -hmm. our 40 years of our mint sets from 1968 to 2009 that's going to be coming your way if you'd like to call in advance um, it all comes in original packaging our item number is 513-319 if you'd like to dial in or go on to our website at hsn.com i did the math on this this is basically every uncirculated coin made by the united states to government penny nickel dime quarter half dollar and dollar from 1968 to 2009 including a complete set of the state quarters and just the dollar coins in there which aren't even in every set are about $599 if, if purchased separately. Wow. I hope that you're excited. We're going to give you a full look at that coming up in a matter of moments. Well, if you are away from your television, come a little closer because take a look at what we have right now. I've got wow. a set of presidential dollars. Whoa. Are those amazing? And, and it's funny, we have the box. It was sold out and we finally just restocked it. I have this box empty for $149. So you can go to hsn.com, we've got that. Uh, these have already started selling. Here's what this is. This is every single solitary one of the presidential dollars from both the Philadelphia Mint and the Denver Mint, gem brilliant uncirculated in their own individual uh, uh, exclusive holder, exclusive to us here at HSN. Every single one of them in a $150 box, 78 gem brilliant uncirculated circulated sold out limited edition coins the entire thing at two hundred and ninety nine dollars now what I had to do is you can see oh you're going okay well what's really all in here I set up the wall of coins over there that's what's in the box Okay, plus all the certificates of authenticity. Nice. So, uh, so those are all the coins. So they started the Presidential Dollar Series in 2007 with George Washington. They did four coins per year until they honored each president that was eligible. Uh, deceased to be able to be put on a United States coin. And then this year with President Reagan, they just finished the series. <clears throat> it is done. It's gone. Every coin a sold out limited edition. This is the first and best opportunity that I have had to get both the Philadelphia and Denver minted coins in Gem Brilliant Uncirculated. We've sold just P or D at $199 sold thousands and thousands and thousands of them in a frame, okay? We just sold thousands of mm -hmm. those. We did the same thing in a, in a box, but I've never been able to bring you because so many of these are so much more difficult. You can get the P, but you can't get the D, the Philadelphia Mint, but you can't get the Denver Mint. Look at this, every one of them stunningly beautiful, every one of them stunning uncirculated, and the set absolutely positively complete, as you can see right here. What I'd like to do, if we can, is, is walk over here, and we'll, and we'll show you maybe on uh, hsn.com, we'll show you the box. If By the just... way, you can see the size of the box. It, it might go. be difficult for you to tell, but if you look online, yeah, uh, you're right. What is it there, 149 $149.95 empty. And has two perfect five-star reviews, right. by the way. <laughs> and that's empty with nothing in it. There's not a thing um, in it. And by the way, it's impressive. The size of this box, it's, oh. it's 27 and a quarter inches long. It's a piece of furniture. For sure. I, mean, it's a, it, I think it weighs about 10 pounds because this is solid red oak, too. This isn't cardboard or right. any of that fiberboard. Wow. That is solid red oak with solid brass uh, 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 hinges and everything else. So here's what we have for this is what's in the set. So the United States government wanted us to use dollar coins instead of dollar bills. And so they started with what was called the American Golden Dollar Series, the Presidential Dollar Series, based on the popularity of the United States government's state quarter program. And so they started with George Washington, and they did them in the order of presidency until we're done down there with Ronald Reagan. 
Here's the key to the collectability, desirability, and why everybody is trying to get these and simply can't. After 2007, when they initially released these, we decided, wow, these are really cool coins, but we're really fond of our dollar bills. We're not gonna use these. So legislation says that they had to continue to make the coins, but nothing in the legislation said that they had to release the coins to the general public. So they did not. They were only available in special like collector rolls or bags. You could not get the coins individually. And so very few people even tried. And so because of that, these are some of the rarest and most desirable modern issue uncirculated coins put out by the United States government. Yet you get every single one of them. There were 39 different presidential dollars. You get two of each one, a Philadelphia Mint and a Denver Mint. Now remember, there's no, uh, uh, you know, uh, 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 any of our uh, audition or anything like that. This is complete. The whole... There's nothing else yeah. that you need Which yet. is great. It comes comes with the box, so you don't have to buy the box. It comes with the packaging. We sell these for $2.99 a piece empty. But if you wanted to try to put your own presidential dollars in, I guess if you could find them, uh, you could do that. The key to this is a absolutely complete uncirculated set, two coins from every president, because you get the Philadelphia Mint and the Denver Mint in the incredible custom box for only $299. So literally, we sold thousands and thousands and thousands of these at $199, okay? We're going to give you all the other coins and a $149 box. So if you take that out of the uh, equation, it's like getting all the coins before for $149 and you get twice as many coins. So that's the incredible part, and it is absolutely positively complete. There's nothing else you need. So you get that and instant that. gratification, mm -hmm. completely giftable. If you don't want to wait, this is going to be ideal for you. Our HSN price is $299.95. And, of course, it's easy to order with us, whether you shop with us on hsn.com or you've downloaded our app to your mobile phone or tablet or you call our toll-free 800 number. But definitely an opportunity for you to be able to see the wide selection and to get something that's unique and special and really quite beautiful oh, you know it, it's it's an amazing presentation unlike anything else wow that i've is never out seen there. this before you know yeah, well no because we I've had not these seen specially this. Made. this is new for we me. have sold a tremendous number of these boxes empty at 149 dollars because it is the single most uh, uh, um, impressive oh yes yeah, it's, yeah, it's about 10, yeah, 10 it's 12 nice. pounds just it's for the box itself got a nice handle itself. on the side Every single coin set, you get Philadelphia and Denver Mint. Every single coin set, you're going to get its own individual certificate of authenticity that you're going to see here. And like I said, P and D, so you can see the front and the back of every single one of these coins. It is a truly exceptional collector opportunity. The biggest problem with collecting presidential dollars is once again, they were never released into circulation. So because of that, so few people have them, yeah. and because every one of them is a sold out limited edition. See, it started in 2007, 2008. By the time you have to 2010, there's just nobody has any of them. We've literally been stockpiling these for 10 years to give us the opportunity wow. to be able to sell the entire set. So once again, nothing else that you need purchase here. It comes with the with the uh, custom presentation chest that you see here. You get all of the coins, every Philadelphia Mint, every Denver Mint, absolutely perfectly preserved, and every coin original, gem, brilliant, uncirculated, unlike anything that you have ever seen. Uh, or had the opportunity to own. We have never sold a set with both the Philadelphia and Denver Mint. So there are 39 coins in the set, but you get 78 because you get all of the P's yeah. and Which all of right. the D's, every single one of them, a sold out limited edition that by law can never be made again. Far rarer than the state quarters, far rarer than the national parks quarters. It is just, <laughs> be careful. Cause that'll that, I'll, that'll I'll give you a finger. pretty good pinch right there because you can see, and I just kind of want to pick this up oh, wow. and show you just how impressive this incredible case is. That's really beautiful, is. isn't it? Isn't that a, just a gorgeous yeah. uh, uh, case? And all of them fit in there so nicely. Uh, each one has its own individual slot. So, uh, And you have a little extra room over there for uh, other jewelry, other coins, uh, other uh, min sets and proof sets fit nicely into that. So it's just uh, a, one of those truly spectacular collector opportunities. Well, I think with this being an election year and a lot of interest mm -hmm. in 
presidents in the history of our country. It's going to be great for any of you who are history buffs. Mm -hmm. uh, love, you know, kind of that the presidential history that, that happens. And so a lot of times people will ask you, well, I'm interested in collecting coins. You know, how do I start? You know, what, right. what, what, what do I buy? Well, how about the presidential dollars? Once again, one of the rarest series put out by the United States government over the last 50 years or so because they were never released to the general public. That's and the neat. other key to this is, is one call gets them all. This is an absolutely positively complete set. So there's nothing else you need buy. You get the complete golden dollar set with the fantastic solid red oak presentation case that you can see right here. All of it. This $149.95 empty has two five-star uh, uh, customer picks to it, as you can see right there. Each coin individually displayed and preserved right. for generations, uh, generations to come. And like I said, such a unique opportunity for you to own the complete set of presidential. And if you've been out there trying to find these, you realize there's just nobody that has all, all of, of them. them. Yeah. You can maybe get one of each coin, but you certainly can't get two of each coin. Uh, you know, you're going to get both the Philadelphia Mint and the Denver Mint. That is the extraordinarily difficult part of this, and that is what your opportunity is for kind of one time, uh, uh, one last call on this, because our quantities are so phenomenally limited. I'm able to offer fewer than a thousand sets yes. of these forever. Wow. Uh, because that's all of the coins I have. Many of the coins like the uh, 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 Abraham Lincoln, good luck finding those for five, six, eight, ten, twelve, fifteen dollars a piece. You're going to get two of those. Remember, you get seventy-eight dollar coins in this, and then of course the incredible Red Oak presentation. Well, thank box. you so much for your phone calls here. More to come. As a matter of fact, we want to give you some updates. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, we're just really getting warmed up, but we have sold out of that silver skull. I knew that one would go. That was one that I wanted for my collection, but we still have remaining our 24 karat gold, but we only have about 40. So if you're interested in that skull, the golden skull, uh, give us a call, 522-208. Might I remind you also that you can certainly shop with us by using FlexPay um, with any of those selections. But coming up um, next hour, it is a two hour show and we've got lots of ground that we want to cover for you. Coming up next hour, we have our half a century of our proof sets from 1960 to 2009. And that will be offered at a price break, which means it's on sale. Mm -hmm. So look for that. That is coming your way next hour. Last airing at price break. Last airing at price break on our half century of proof sets, one of the single most popular sets that we've ever uh, done. All right, so we were just talking about Ronald Reagan, right? This is, what's the best way to put this? This is one of the most exceptional sets that I've ever been able to offer you in terms of value, in terms of collectability. I'm gonna split these a little bit because I really wanna get that medallion in there. The United States government, in this presidential dollar series that I was just mm -hmm. talking about, they have released kind of intermittently between their special sets that are called the Queen and Chronicle set, which chronicle the history of certain of the presidents. Okay, and they come with this, and they come with a book, and so on, and that's the oh, really? queen, nice. and there's the chronicles, sure. uh, is what they have. And, and they've been relatively popular over time, but last year they did something special. With the Harry Truman coin, they reverse they, they they released the presidential dollar in reverse proof for the very first time. Now we may or may not, I'm not 100 percent sure, have on HSN.com some of the Harry Truman sets, which is a reverse proof presidential dollar with a stamp. None of this other stuff is here. It has a it has a silver medallion and a stamp. All right. I believe our current price on that is somewhere if we have them between eleven hundred and fifteen hundred dollars. Wow. Okay? For the for the Harry Truman. Right. And then they released the uh, uh, the Eisenhower. There we go. I'm sorry. Twelve hundred ninety nine dollars. If we can look at that. There yeah. we go. There it is. As you can see, with a silver medallion and the reverse proof price. Twelve hundred ninety nine dollars. We sold hundreds of those sets at at a thousand dollars plus. That was the first one. Then they did the Dwight David Eisenhower. We have some of the Eisenhower sets. Once again, a reverse proof presidential dollar and a silver medallion. I think we are $599 on, on the Eisenhower set. Okay. Then they released the, uh, the Johnson, Lyndon B. Johnson. 
Uh, that set in 70, we don't have any. The last sale price I had on that was $3,000 in 70 wow. for the reverse proof and that. And then we had the John F. Kennedy. There's four reverse proof dollars before this one. And the John F. Kennedy we have at $699. Once again, with just the, sure. the, that and the, uh, and the medallion. This year, <clears throat> they did President uh, Ford and President Nixon. They did not do a Coin and Chronicles set. They waited until the last coin in the series the Ronald Reagan, the only coin that Ronald Reagan has or is likely to ever appear on, and they released it in reverse proof. Here's the amazing part. So I have the Ronald Reagan. If it stood on its own with the other coins ranging from $599 to $4,000 or $3,000, the eyes are yeah. you can put whatever number you want on it, uh, uh, or the Johnson, rather. You can, you, it's just, it's impossible to get in 70. I have the Ronald Reagan for $299. Now, I have to understand, this is only available in this Coin and Chronicles set, this reverse proof, and the first day of issue annex is available exclusively uh, from us here at HSN, for, and there's only 980 of these, already 120 gone, by the way, just like that. 980 in the entire limited edition. So by itself, if I took all this other stuff away and we had this at $299, it would be an extraordinary opportunity. The rarest Ronald Reagan coin that has or will ever be produced by the United States government that is an actual coin. The rarest of the reverse proof, pre or the least expensive of the, of the reverse proof presidential dollars, and arguably the most popular of all of those presidents is of course going to be the Ronald Reagan. So standing alone at $299, it's exceptional. Now I want to talk about this coin. The United States government this year did a special 30th anniversary proof American silver eagle. And this is that coin. It's got the 30th anniversary edge lettered on here. We have sold thousands yes, and thousands have. and thousands of these at $179.95. I will sell it later in this show for $179.95 and I will sell a ton of them. This coin is that coin, but even rarer because it comes also out of the Coin and Chronicles set. When it's certified out of the Coin and Chronicles, it becomes literally 10 times rarer than the coin I'm selling for $179. None of the other Coin and Chronicle sets has got a proof silver eagle. They just have a medallion. This one also has a medallion, but it also has got the proof silver eagle, and I'm less than half the price of all of the other sets that are out there. That's what makes this such an amazing and incredible opportunity. That and the fact that it's 100% exclusive to us here at, uh, at HSN. And then the price at only $299. When you see out there, the lowest other price on a set uh, in the reverse proof, uh, presidential dollars that I can do? $599. We are literally half the price. And I have a $179 coin as a part of the set that is a part of no other of those sets. Comes with the Red Oak presentation box, comes with all the original packaging, comes with the, uh, 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 the Coin and Chronicle set that you have right here. By the time you put all of that together, this may well be the most exceptional coin value and coin opportunity that I have been able to bring you in quite some time. Yeah, it kind of yeah. it kind of slipped in because what happened is is the government released this 30th anniversary proof American Silver Eagle. And that kind of gobbled up all the, you know, the news and numismatics because it was such an incredibly popular coin and they've been wait we've been waiting for them to release it since January. And so when that happened, all of a sudden nobody paid attention to this set. Now you've got one of the rarest, what, there's only five reverse proof presidential dollars. Not one of which you can basically get for less than $600 here at HSN, except for this one. Like I said, now you have the Ronald Reagan, arguably the most desirable, certainly the most popular. And once again, this is the only coin. Like the Dwight David Eisenhower, he has other coins that he's, uh, uh, that he's on uh, as well. And arguably, and, and it's going to be the rarest coin that President Ronald Reagan will ever be on. You also get the medallion here, which has President and Nancy Reagan on it as well. So you get the medallion, just like the other sets, but it's like you get this incredible bonus proof American Silver Eagle out here to the side, only 980 in the limited edition. Only 980 in the limited edition for the pairs. And this coin, 179.95 in the regular issue, now add in 
from the Coin and Chronicle set. The only thing similar to this is when they did a special Silver Eagle uh, of in 2006 that went in the 20th anniversary set. The regular coin was like $99, but same coin certified out of the 20th anniversary, double the price. Okay. So there's a huge, I, I can make a, a tremendous argument that this coin right here should be $299 by itself. I can make an absolutely ironclad argument that this coin should be $299 by itself. So to get both of them at $299, you don't have to pick plus the Red Oak presentation box, right. plus this, plus the medallion, all the original government packaging, like I said, a truly exceptional opportunity. Absolutely. So if you'd like to have it, uh, definitely give us a ring. Uh, one of my favorites is the medallion that you get, because uh, if you know any little bit of history of Ronald Reagan, you know how absolutely important Nancy Reagan was uh, to Ronald Reagan and how in love they were. And so I, th this whole collection, I think, is, is phenomenal. Six minutes remaining on the clock if you would love to order. Very easy to shop with us at HSN. Um, we typically give you a 30-day money-back guarantee, but one of the nice things about shopping during this time of year is that we give you that extended holiday return policy. And so you can shop with tremendous confidence, whether you are a history buff. Um, and as, of course, as Mike mentioned, Ronald Reagan for sure, um, I would imagine, and I would say arguably, definitely one of the most popular, for sure. That's right. And so from a numismatic standpoint, let's go back and look at it once again from right. a numismatic standpoint. <clears throat> Excuse me. Is what you've got is, and, and people, uh, uh, if you're not familiar, I want to explain to you what the reverse proof is. When a regular coin that they make in proof, the outside of the coin, this part of the coin is the mirror finish. The inside or the device, the raised part of the coin is the matte finish, all right? When they reverse the proof, and it's a very specific way, and they've only made, uh, I think, a, uh, like 10 reverse proof coins in the history of the United States government. There's only 10 total in the history of the United States government. Of course, this is the only one that's Ronald Reagan. Five of them are these presidential dollars. And like I said, the, the, the least expensive other one other than this is, like I said, $599. And that doesn't even take into account we have $179 proof silver eagle that goes with it as well so that makes it even more desirable more collectible uh, uh, and everything else the the thing about this is is like i said it took everybody by surprise and when it does that then it gives us an opportunity to get you value, unlike anything else. And so what happened is, is this is my original issue price. The Truman I originally started, I think, at about $399, and it went to $1,299 oh, when all of a sudden people started going crazy right, for it. Right. And that's exactly what is happening here. Oh, I would imagine <clears throat> that will happen here. Yeah, sure. so we're already 20 25% sold through the entire quantity, this being the very first prime time presentation that we have ever been able to do on this. So this is not, do not confuse this with the regular Re uh, President Reagan golden dollar you've seen. It's not the same coin. Do not confuse it with the proof coin, which we have sold for, I think it was $49, $59, $79, just for the regular proof coin. This is the reverse proof coin, which is, is exponentially rarer than the mint state coin. <clears throat> and then as a part of this set, you get this, and it's not like I added this. It came as part of this wow. set. And many people ask, why did they put the American Proof Silver Eagle in there? <clears throat> because when the American Silver Eagle was created in 1986, the president that signed the Liberty Coin Act into law was, of course, President Ronald Reagan. So he created the American Silver Eagle. So yeah. in the 30th anniversary of the American Silver Eagle, it makes sense that he would be, of course, the only yeah, president yeah. that is honored with a, sure. a Silver Eagle in his Coin and Chronicles set. <clears throat> so, of course, that makes abundant sense for, uh, uh, for you to figure that out and to be able to collect that. What it gives you, though, is a phenomenally unique numismatic opportunity. Collectability at a level because you have a phenomenally rare type of coin anyway. They did 39 different presidential dollars. Only five of them have got a reverse proof component. And of those five, this is the only one I can sell you for less than $500 for this coin.
let alone as the set. The other set's, you know, 600 to two or 3,000. This one, you're going to get the proof Silver Eagle certified absolutely perfect with this as well in the Red Oak presentation box, all with the original government packaging, making this one, yeah. once again one of the great collectibles and more importantly, one of the great collectible values that I've been able to offer in some time because this is my original issue price. And while it took much of the collecting world by surprise, it did not take us by surprise. We were ready for this. <coughs> I knew this would be an exceptional coin and it absolutely has been. At this point, like I said, almost a quarter of the entire edition. Now, once this 980 coins, which is available exclusively from us here at HSN, you cannot get that. Remember, this coin, is only available in this set, set right. from the United States government. This coin, with this label, Coin and Chronicles, only available in this set. So all told, you have got three, in essence, unique coins to this set. This coin available no place else. The rarest permutation and one of the most popular coins put out by the United States government this year going to be right here in this set, as you see. Now, we have fewer than 800. So like I said, about 20% of these gone. With everybody on the phone, we're down into probably the six or even 500s. Many people buying multiples, understanding that at this price, you simply can cannot buy an Annex first day of issue for less than $299. It's just that simple. Because this price, as you see right here, is our original issue price. Now, if you take a look at the Truman, we had to go up in price. We had to take a look at the Eisenhower, we had to go up in price. The Johnson, we had to go up in price. This one, still at original issue pricing. So crucial to that, you are going to get all of the original government packaging. This is where the coins fit into the, right here. So you can see here's the medallion, here's the Silver Eagle, and here's the Ronald Reagan coin. You're going to get the uh, booklet that explains, uh, uh, you know, the history of, of uh, President Reagan from birth through his presidency, as you can see right there, uh, all that through all of uh, uh, all the history of President Reagan. And then, of course, you're going to have the Red Oak presentation box that comes with this as well, along with each one of these coins certified absolutely positively perfect absolutely positively perfect one of those great collectibles that comes along certainly once in a year once every five years once every 10 years the rarest ronald reagan president reagan coin that will ever be produced in absolutely perfect condition and in a limited edition of less than a thousand including the american 30th anniversary proof silver eagle like i said which is edge lettered the only proof silver eagle that has ever been edge lettered or only silver eagle that has ever been edge lettered in the history of the United States government. Well, we want to thank you so very much. Please continue to ask about this. It's been a very popular choice tonight, but don't forget to look at some of the other choices online. Um, so if you want some of the additional reverse proof, you've talked about the fact that there were uh, there are five. Uh, we do have a few of them on our website. Also available for you, let's take a look. This is our 2016 first day of issue in our Ro Ronald Reagan Coin Chronicles set. This is at 2 $49.95. Tell me a little bit about this. It's the same exact set, just one grade lower. I got gotcha. you. See, that one was graded perfect. Perfect. This one is mince, is a I reverse gotcha. proof 69 and proof 69. I got gotcha. you. So. All right, so go for the perfect one if you can. Absolutely. Why wouldn't you? <laughs> Why wouldn't you, right? And it's not that much difference. Hey, we've got a question for you. Gold coins were not legal tender at a certain part of the U.S. history. Is that true or false? We'll give you the answer on the other side. You girls and guys, our customers, have b basically curated the show for us. It's the show everyone is buzzing about, and it's all about you, our customer. Join me, Jeff Cowan, and Colleen Lopez for the only show that makes you the decision maker. We'll reveal the gifts you voted on as the stars of our gift show live October 30th at 7 p.m. Go to hsn.com and search customer celebration for more. plastic could make your holiday so happy just in time for gifting get $20 off when you apply and are approved for the HSN card plus extra flex offers no interest VIP financing and an additional $10 off your next purchase when you receive your new card all with no annual fees apply now call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com make HSN your home for the holidays
Watch Lancôme Paris, Saturday on HSN. Okay, so the question was, gold coins were not legal tender at a certain part of U.S. history. Is the answer true or false? Let's take a look at the answer. True. Very good for those of you who got that correct. In 1933, President Roosevelt ordered that circulation of gold coins was not allowed anymore. The coins were turned into the banks by people who were given other types of currency in exchange, and most of the coins were melted. Indeed. Of course, it was legal to still own them as coins if you wanted to keep them. You could keep them as coins. Okay. And some people did because we sell those coins here today. So. We do indeed. We do indeed. Uh, this, by the way, is Mike Bizek. Mike happens to be our resident numismatist, and I'm your host. And the next couple of coins that you're going to see, we're going to be going at a little bit of a faster pace. So we just want you to, to prepare you for it because we've got a lot of great values back to back that we're going to be showcasing for you. Uh, out the gate, we're going to start off with this 2016 five ounce silver National Park bullion coin. Look at it. Yeah. Um, 999 fine silver, five ounces of pure silver. So you're awesome. starting with over a quarter pound of pure silver. And if you look, you can go out there in nationally advertised catalogs and find five, find five ounce silver bars for 179, 189. But understand this is not just five ounces of silver. This is an actual United States government issue coin. This is the National Park Quarters. This is actually a quarter dollar. Here's an actual size quarter, but they made it like this. So when they started doing the National Parks Quarters in 2010, the United States government made a commensurate five ounce silver piece for each one of the quarters that have been made in the series. Now those coins from 2010 with similar mintages to all of these, they all have similar mintages, uh, sell for as much as, as six, seven, eight hundred, a thousand dollars certified on a per coin basis. You go to the coins from 2012, 2013, and you're looking at coins that are $300, $500, $600. What I have got right here is the brand new issue of the American 5-ounce America the Beautiful. Now, this is the last one that was released, the Teddy Roosevelt, Theodore Roosevelt, already, in essence, a sold-out limited edition. Okay, already a sold out limitation. We had about 3,000 of these. I'm down to the final 250. So understand, so what we've got here is an amazing coin. By law, the maximum mintage of any of these five ounce America the Beautifuls is 120,000. None of them basically get to that. Most of them are about 40,000 or 50,000. That's why they sell out so incredibly quickly. We sell so many of these and we sell them so fast. Uh, I get everyone, they do not, the government does not sell these directly to the general public either. They only go through a system or a series of, of uh, certified bullion dealers. Fortunately, we're part of that system. So this is the brand new one. This is the Theodore Roosevelt. Remember, you're starting, the backdrop of this is five ounces of pure silver. Then you have got right there, pure silver, 999 fine, five ounces. So you've got this incredible bullion value with this that we put on flex pay, which is amazing. But then the numismatic value. So you have the backdrop of over a quarter of a pound of silver, the largest silver coin ever made by the United States government. And then you kind of juxtaposition that against some of the rarest coins. If I had an American silver eagle with this same mintage, because I have one, the 2011 20th anniversary, it's like a thousand dollar coin. This coin just as rare with five times the silver. The biggest reason you have this opportunity is the vast majority of people don't even know that these coins exist. We get them, look, I buy as many as is humanly possible. I probably got 10 to 20% of the entire mintage of the Theodore Roosevelt's that we've sold here uh, on HSN. Our uh, regular HSN customers are some of the uh, most adamant collectors right. uh, of the America 
five ounce America the Beautiful coins. We sell out all the old ones uh, every time we get them. I mean, oh, boom. And I'm going to have right after this for just a minute or two minutes, I'm going to give you a couple of coins I've only got dozens of right. in final quantities while we're getting ready for the last coin of 2016, which will be coming out uh, uh, shortly. So we're ready for the next one. I want to put this up, and I believe we have Cumberland Gap, right? Is, is that correct? There we go. And so this one, also a 2016 coin. As you can see, customer pick. Still $189.95. Now, if I can get the quantity on this, I believe, and this is final quantities on Cumberland Gap, is what I've got here. Uh, I believe I've got 40, 40 or 50 coins at okay. the very most. So how many? 49. 49 coins. Yep. And we're just going to spend, what, a couple, is that two minutes, one minute, two yep. minutes, whatever it is. I got 49 coins is all I have left in the Cumberland Gap. Now, once you get those sold out, I remember we sold the Saratogas for $169. Silver was a little cheap. Cheaper. Today, I'm like, for the Saratogas, I'm $249. Already, you have about a 50% increase in price. So I've got the final 49 Cumberland Gaps. We had several thousands of these, and I'm down to the last four dozen of those as well. So that's the last look on this uh, uh, with those. And then just really quick, I think one minute, I think these are just about as rare, the Harper's Ferry. I have 77 of the Harper's Ferry. I'm basically giving you the entire 2016 set to date. Yeah. So uh, if you bought the Theodore Roosevelt, then we had the Cumberland, Harper's Ferry was the next one back, then Cumberland Gap, or then uh, actually Shawnee, and then Cumberland Gap. If you buy these four, you'll get all, you'll have the entire set from 2016, and then you'll be ready for the Fort Moultrie, which is coming out in about two weeks or so. Well, here's the thing, too. All of them are available on Plex Pay. Uh, yeah, I don't know that we've ever, we may have never done that. No, before. I mean, each of them. So that's a real advantage that you should consider because, because especially because some of them were down to the final few dozen. Um, so here's our final one. Yeah, and as you can see, four and a half star customer pick. We're going to give you about three minutes here. This was the first coin in 2016. So they release five of these five ounce coins every year. Okay. Okay. The fifth one has not yet been released this year. You said These about are the two four. Weeks. They're about two, two to three weeks, okay. something like that. The first four are already out there, and that's what I'm offering you. These are my absolute final quantities. We had sold, when the Shawnees came out, I had an incredible opportunity to buy about 15% of the entire mintage. We bought 8,000 of these coins. We've sold 7,700 of them. Wow. I have 300 remaining. Yeah. I have held my price at $179 because this was the first one in the year. So you see the other ones were 189 you, yeah. This one, $179. The reason being silver was cheaper by $2 an ounce back then. So I could charge you. I paid $10 less, you paid $10 less. Same exact thing. So here's the Shawnee as well. The first coin of 2006. So, uh, like I said, we had thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of these coins, and now I'm down to 300 of these, 200 of the Teddy Roosevelt's, and about two dozen each of the Cumberland Gap and the Harper's Ferry. And that's going to be it. That's that's all said and done. And then we'll do the Fort Moultrie at the end of 2016, and then we'll be ready for 2017. 2017. Okay. I occasionally bring in prior year coins, but they always sell at a premium. Okay. 229, 249, 260. 279, 299. I had a couple of them at I think 329. The sold out. I bring in 100 coins. They're sold out instantly. Remember, five ounces pure silver. Five ounces pure silver in each and every one of these coins. Five ounces. So that's the backdrop of value. Then look at this and understand this is a coin. Do not confuse this with a silver bar or an ingot or any of those other things. This is an actual and physical coin, which is of incredible importance as a collector for you to understand that you are getting a coin that if this was a silver eagle, it would be the fourth rarest silver eagle. I can't sell you the fourth rarest silver eagle for $179, in particular one that has five 
times the silver of an irregular American silver eagle. So these are underappreciated gems, the largest silver coins ever made by the United States government. Yet I have them right here for you at my original issue prices and all of those incredible flex yeah. pays. Well, enjoy because as we've mentioned, we don't get to share flex pay with you on a lot of the coins. So this is an exceptional opportunity for you to be able to pick up all four. We, in fact, have more to come. But first, we want to check in with Adam Freeman, who's going to fill us in on the spotlight and all things electronics. HSN is the perfect place to find gifts. This week, look for great deals on tech gifts. Spend $40 or more on toys and get free shipping. Plus, free shipping and flex on select gifts on the go. And it's easy to upgrade with six flex pay and free shipping on select Dell computers. Gamers, keep an eye out for VIP financing on gaming items. Visit hsn.com and search electronics for more great products. Italy, a land known for luxury, heritage, and style, comes Perlier. Exquisitely crafted, natural ingredients, where tradition meets modern science. The ultimate spa experience. No appointment necessary. Shop Perlier Tuesday. At HSN, we know we're the best way to holiday. This kind of magic happens once a year. Where else can you get fashion tips from me? Or holiday crafting tips from me? Always be mistletoe ready. So come cook with me. Let's decorate together. How are you showing? Let's create something great. Oh, what fun it is to make HSN your home for the holidays. 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 So nice to have you shopping with us as we feature for you great coins and hopefully you'll find something in the show that you love. We are going to get to a really interesting part of the show and I do hope that you will take some time to come a little closer to your television as Mike Mizek, who happens to be our resident numismatist, which is a coin expert, kind of takes us through this tremendous value. It was safe for this show, so even if you watch a little bit earlier, you have not seen this. So tell us a little bit about what we're seeing. Well, you you know, we, we sell a lot of proof sets here. In the next hour, I have my 50 years sure. of proof sets. Might well be the best selling item we've ever had at HS, and I've probably sold. 100,000 sets or wow. however many I get my hands on yeah. in 15 years. That's how many I've sold. Because every time we get them, we sell them out. But a set that I rarely get, that I almost never get, is complete sets of mint sets. Now remember, proof's not a condition, it's a mess of manufacturing. So proof sets are made differently. What a mint set is, is the United States government creating and taking every one of the uncirculated coins that they make in a year and putting them in a set from, they're called a mint set. So it's all of the uncirculated coins from 1968, basically, through 2009. Every Philadelphia and every Denver minted coin. I like coin. that, yeah. So you should have on your card there how many coins this is. It's like a ridiculous. 562. So basically a buck a coin. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, basically yeah. a dollar a coin. Actually, yeah. is, is what you're looking yeah, for at. Sure. Over 500 and every one of them in the original government packaging. Every coin in here, original, gem, brilliant, uncirculated. Now, we've got 40 years. Now, if you'll notice, there's 42 years covered there. Because in 1982 and 1983, they didn't make mint sets. So it's not like I'm okay. shorting you. The government didn't make them. Well, so when I say 40 years, I'm going to give you 40 years of sets. We have to cover 42 years to do that, okay? Now here's the amazing part, and here's the reason we can't get mint sets. One of the incredible things that we, that we do and coin dealers do is they sell you complete sets of Eisenhower dollars, or complete sets of Kennedy half dollars, or complete sets of state quarters, or whatever it is. 
But where do you get all these old gem brilliant uncirculated coins? Well, the easiest thing to do is cut open mint sets because these are government issued. And so for each one of these, for instance, here's a 1991, you're going to get all of the Philadelphia mint. So each year has two packages, the Philadelphia minted package and the Denver minted package uh, that you're going to have in there. And they're all gem brilliant uncirculated. So uh, th that's where you start with. But then when you start looking at the individual value, the reason you never see these is like I said, the dirty little secret of coin dealers is we take these things and we cut them up and charge you five times $599. I just went and looked at like the nationally advertised catalog. If you take just the Eisenhower dollars, so you start in 1973 and you get the Philadelphia Mint and Denver Mint Eisenhower dollar. Those are $27.95 a piece. Remember, you're paying a dollar a coin. $54. The 1974, uh, I think they're $15.95 a coin. The Eisenhower dollars are $375 coin by coin. The Eisenhower dollars. So we're looking at a 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 12 of the coins. 12 of the 500 coins are 300 plus dollars. If you look at the Susan B. Anthony dollars in here, there's going to be three, six, nine. Uh, there's eight of those. They're $150. So you're about wow. $500 there. Then when you add in the Sacagawea golden dollars, the Philadelphia Endeavor Mint, almost $200 there. So just the silver dollars, which start in 73, and they're not even in every year, just the silver dollars and the Eisenhower dollars and the Susan B's and the, I'm not even counting about the presidential dollars. That's right, you get all the presidential dollars, Philadelphia never meant 2007, 2008, uh, uh, and 2009. So you're going to get 30 presidential dollars is another 150. So just the dollar coins in here are about $650 right. or so. So at the end of the day, and I, and I went through here, and then you have all the Kennedy half dollars. Now you're going to get in here basically 74 Kennedy half dollars on an average of, of uh, eight and a half dollars a piece, another $600 and half dollars. You get a complete Philadelphia and Denver set of all of the state quarters, Jim Brilliant, uncirculated that come in here. Coin by coin, <clears throat> that's another $300. So coin by coin by coin, you are looking at literally thousands of dollars of United States government issue coins, all in the original government packaging. All in the original government packaging. Every Philadelphia mint and every Denver minted coin from 1968 through 2009. Through 2009. So this is the 2009 set. Now remember, at $599, you're paying $15 a set. The face value of this is over $15 because you get all the Denver Minute Coins and all of the Philadelphia Minute Coins. By the way, see these little pennies right here? Those are the 100th anniversary Lincoln cents, and only in the mint sets they were made in pure copper. And when you look at these in pure copper, those coins right there sell for about $17 a piece. You've got almost $70 in pennies in this set, the last set that we have offered in here. So $15 a set. If you buy the mint set today directly from the United States government, you are looking somewhere in the neighborhood of, uh, I think it's about $47 or $48 from the United States mint to buy this year's set, the one that's the original okay. government issue price. We're $15 a set. We are basically a dollar a coin. There's almost no coin in here that's less than a dollar a coin. Even the Lincoln cents, those are, I mean, you know, there's, there's over $80 worth of Lincoln cents just in the 2009 set. So that's the amazing part about this. Uh, uh, how about all of the, uh, like I said, all of the uh, state quarters? You're going to get Philadelphia and, and Denver because we have 1999, 2000, 2001. And as you look at these, like here's the 1999. You're going to get the quarter set, and they're every single one of them in original government packaging. Check this out. So there's all the P and D quarters. And those run in the nationally advertised catalog. Those are about uh, $6.95 a piece. 
So there's 10 of those, that's $70. That's why coin by coin, these are lit this set is literally thousands of dollars, literally thousands of dollars on a coin by coin Which is basis. why people buy this way. And it's why they're yeah. so difficult to get like right. this, because in many instances, particularly in the 1980s, if you're looking to sell Kennedy half dollars, in the 1980s, the 85, the 86, the 87, the 88, they're exceptionally difficult to get in brilliant uncirculated condition. But if you buy a mint set, there's a P and the D. That's why these coins are $16.5 a piece for the Kennedy half dollars. That's why the Kennedy half dollars. So you'll pay more coin by coin for the Kennedy half dollars than $599. You'll pay more for the dollar coins in this set than $599. You'll pay more for the quarters coin by coin than $599. <laughs> then add in the nickels and the dimes and the pennies and you understand, like I said, why this becomes an incredible opportunity for you and why we rarely have the opportunity. I think we, I looked before this, Perhaps you have that, Marlo, the last time that we sold the 40 years of mint sets. I'm sure it was September sometime. Yeah, I, I think it might have been September 9th or something. So we're a month and a half being able to put together 150 sets. Being able to put together 150 sets. I want to look back and I just want to double check like the quarters uh, that are in here. Uh, the United States state quarters. Because I mean, when you look at these coins, Philadelphia and Denver minted, I mean, you're all of a sudden looking at incredible, uh, incredible values for these coins. And you're going to get all of those. You know, you're looking on the quarters here on an average of oh it looks like about three and a half dollars a coin and you get 106 of them you know what i'm saying so uh because yeah. you get 56 or 112 of them so you're looking at to 400 and something dollars just, just for the state quarters so that's 99 that's the last 10 years then you get the last 30 years keep in mind these kennedy half dollars up here the 68 the 69 this 70 by the way see this 70 that's the most valuable modern issue kennedy half dollar the 70 d kennedy is only available in this set this is like a $65 coin right here, this one. The 1970D Kennedy is one of the hallmarks of value in the entire Kennedy half dollar series. And it only comes in the mint set. It was never released into, into public, $49.50. I wanna give you an accurate price, $49.50 for this one single coin. And so that's why when you look at the Kennedys, these are $18.5 a piece. So there's $100 worth of Kennedy halves the first three years. And then you add in, oh, by the way, you get all the, uh, there are four or bicentennial Eisenhower dollars, type one and type two, from series from 1975 and 1976. So you get all of the, uh, like I said, the Eisenhowers alone, over $300 in value, over $300 in value. Now, the key to this, all in original government packaging, you see people literally try to repackage these. Because, you know what, you can't put the toothpaste back in the tube, uh, <laughs> is ultimately what it comes down to. And so what you've got, I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to put this over here, because I want to start looking at, like, for instance, my favorite set is probably this one. This is the largest mint set ever put out by the United States government. You're going to get in this every single one of the presidential dollars. This is one year. This is $15 you're paying for this. The 2009. And then you're going to have right here, then you get the Sacagawea golden dollars right in here. You get the Sacagaweas. And then you get the Kennedys. You get all of the, uh, uh, these are the, uh, uh, remember from the state quarters? These are the territorial quarters, all six of those. So there's the, the other one up there. So all six of those, Philadelphia and Denver Mint, all put together. Just a spectacular opportunity. Now the one thing from a pure value standpoint, by far the most difficult to get is the 2008 set that you see right here. This 2008 set for both the presidential dollars and all of the quarters that are up here, these Hawaii quarters up here, they're like $27.5 a piece. I mean, they're just so difficult because these are satin finish that only come in these special mint sets. So that's the other thing that happens is starting in 2006, the United States government starts making the mint sets with satin finish only. So the coins that are in here are absolutely positively unique, making them now some of the rarest coins. So taken as a whole, 
There are coins that are only available in these mint sets. These mint sets are extraordinarily difficult to get. And so because of that, when we get them in, I'm extraordinarily proud that I'm able to give these to you in original government yes. packaging. Far rarer than the proof sets. Significantly ra uh, rarer than the proof sets. I know, we're you're just showing here, last time I was there was the 14th of September. The 14th of September was the last time that this was aired. I has taken me all this time just to put together literally, you know, about 12 dozen sets. <laughs> uh, and understand, we're one of the largest uh, coin dealers in the United States. We have access to everything all the time. But what happens is, is you can't get 2008 sets. You can't get 77 sets. All of a sudden, everybody wants Eisenhower dollars uh, uh, from 1978, the last year of issue. And so the only way to get nice, brilliant, uncirculated coins is out of the mint sets. That's why there's 17 and a half dollars a piece. That's why there's 34 dollars worth of uh, Eisenhower dollars there, and all of a sudden those just disappear. If there's one coin set that I feel over the course of the, all the, the couple decades I've been here that is the single most difficult to get on a day by day, week by week, month by month basis. It's clearly going to be the United States government issue mint sets. There's absolutely positively no doubt about that. And so when we have them available, uh, and this is the last time I'm going to probably air them in this year, okay. the last time I'm probably going to air them in this year when I have them you need to take full advantage. Buy like a coin dealer. Like I said, the dirty little secret of coin yes. dealers is, is we'd much rather take these, bust them open, and, and like Charge I said, more. instead of $5.99,